With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, in this question at time t is equals to 0, two bodies A and B at same point. A moves with a constant velocity V. B starts from rest and moves with a constant acceleration. Relative velocity of B with respect to A when the bodies meet each other. In this question, two bodies meet each other. That means the speed of first body is equal to speed of second body. And bodies are A and B. So we can say that at some time, at some time, at some time t, S A is equal to S B. Suppose for A body velocity B V A and for B body velocity B V B. So we can say that for body A, for body A, that is the distance equals to distance is written as velocity of A into time. So velocity of A into time is equals to and initially it is at rest so u is equals to 0 and we know that s is equals to ut plus half at square u is equals to 0 so s is equals to half a t square so we use this formula so we can write here that is v a into t is equals to half a t square so this is half a t square so acceleration a can be written as this is equals to and t, one t and one t will be cancelled out so a is equals to twice of v a and divided by t so this is the acceleration now we have to find that the relative speed with this b with respect to a so we can write here that is v b for b body that is v b is equals to u plus a t u plus a t and u is equals to 0 so v b can be written as equals to a t now we know that a, a value of acceleration a is equals to 2 v a by t multiplied t so t and t will be cancelled out and v b is equals to twice of v a so we write here v b is equals to twice of v a now in this question we have to find that the relative velocity of b with respect to a so velocity of b with respect to a can be written as this is equals to v b minus v a and v b we find here that it is equals to twice of v a so this is twice of v a and minus v a is equals to v a so we can say that v b a is equals to v a now from the question in the question it is given that that the velocity of a moves with the constant velocity v so v a is equals to v so we put here and we can say that v b a is equals to v a and this is equals to v so the answer is matched with the option third so this is the right answer i hope you understood thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today